Hello, happy Tuesday. Um, if you hear any random noises in the background, my dog and cat are not being friends right now, so I do apologize. Um, but I wanted to make this video as a kind of welcome video because our school is transitioning to Google Classroom. Now, those of you with um, older children may already know Google Classroom from the district, but those of you um, who don't have older children or your children are not using Google Classroom, I thought I would use this to kind of introduce you to what your page will look like. Um, so this, what I'm going to show you is not our page. I made a testing page and I am on a separate account so that I can show you what it'll look like from the student perspective. Um, so I'm gonna flip my camera around and I'm going to show you um, what you should see once you get set up with Google Classroom. We will be sending the link out here soon um, and just kind of go through it pretty quick. Uh, so let me... Okay, so now that I have you turned around, you will see that I'm in Google Classroom. Uh, I'm sure you all know this, but just in case, uh, when you're in Google, you just click these little squares, scroll down until you see Google Classroom. Click on it, and you should get something that looks like this. Um, our classroom will look different. It will say Bank 6, Megan and Laura, and it'll have kind of like stars in the background and stuff. Sorry, I'm like gesturing with my hands, but you can't see that. Um, but this is a testing classroom. I invited my other email as a student, so I'm entering this as a student. Um, so we'll enter the classroom, and you'll just see it kind of has a stream. So this is where we will be putting announcements and little discussions like, hey, how are you? How was your weekend? Little videos. Um, so you can see I just kind of uploaded lots of different things. Um, I like to put in videos, so that's going to be fun. Um, and then the thing that this is going to be used for is to keep everything all together. So instead of me texting you about Zoom one day and Miss Laura texting you the other day and both of us texting you about activities and you not knowing who to text, it's just all going to be in here now. Uh, so all the Zoom links will be in here, any reminders that we have will be in here, and then if we send activities, which we will start sending five a week, um, and again, this is just so that we are showing that we are engaging with you, um, activities will be in classwork. And so you'll just come in here and you'll see... Um, I made a random one. I made a little poll about what's your color, favorite color. Um, it should also, I'm going to work to set up that our Google Calendar will be linked. Ignore this. Um, and so you should see things like it'll let us know when classes, if we have a day off. Um, sometimes they like to do trainings. Um, for parents, so I'll put those in. I have to get clarification on putting in all the Zooms, but I'll probably just put in a time and then that it's a one-to-one -one Zoom. I'll try to color code it. Um, but yeah, so you should be able to click on Google Class, Google Calendar, and see this. Um, and then you'll just have to exit out and go back to the classroom. Um, you won't really need the class drive folder. We're, we're just going to link everything in here. If we have videos, we'll link it here. Uh, people, it just shows you who is in here. So that is my other, my Keystone account. Then my classmate, I invited my dad. So you'll be able to see the classmates and the teachers. Um, but you really like, that's not really necessary. Um, so again, Upcoming, we'll show you if there are any assignments that we put due dates on. It's not going to be like school where there's like grades and stuff. If we put a due date, it'll probably just be like, try to get this done by the end of the week. Um, and then we're going to keep the stream for just kind of conversations and announcements. Um, 
So if you're not sure if there's an assignment, just check classwork. So that is basically what our Google Classroom is going to look like. Um, so basically the new changes are that we are going to be uplo uploading or um, assigning five activities a week. And those will just be things like if we're talking about shapes, find all the circles in your house and let us know how many circles there are. Or if we're counting, go outside and count the number of bugs you saw on a walk. Um, or watch this video and let us know what you thought or what your favorite thing is or something like that. Um, so they're not, it's, it's not going to be hard activities. It's not going to be like homework. Um, we're also going to be uploading five videos. So these will be daily videos that we will put in the stream. And these are going to be basically morning meetings. So we'll just do a little greeting song, uh, talk about what we're going to do for that day. Uh, I'll probably try to incorporate some reading because I know we have quite a few friends that have a goal of reading. Um, it's just going to be a little pre-recorded video. So this is not something that the kids are logging on to. It's just something you're watching. A pre-recorded video getting the kids into the habit again of doing a daily morning meeting. Um, and then what you will attend are the continued two class Zooms Thursday at 2, Tuesday at 5.30, sorry I did that backwards, and then your individual meeting whenever you have that. Um, and then on our banner in the classroom, I put our YouTube page for whenever you want to check those out. I put the Capital Area Head Start Laugh, Love, Learn Facebook page, and then I just put a reminder, you are always welcome to email or text us or call us with any questions. Now you can comment down here and be like, hey, I don't know what's going on. Uh, so it's, it's up to you. But this is hopefully a streamlined way of communicating you and making things easy, especially once we're a hybrid and some kids are Monday, Tuesday, and some kids are Thursday, Friday. So I hope that all makes sense. And um, bear with us. We're going to start sending out invites here soon. We're hoping to get everyone on by October 5th. So if you can please join the class by October 5th, that would be wonderful. Um, but of course, you know, with technology, sometimes you have to troubleshoot things. So um, we're looking forward to this. I'm really excited. It's kind of like class dojo or remind uh, just in Google form so I really love those platforms and I think it's going to be a really great way for us to stay connected and for kids to also be able to um, type little messages to their friends now they can kind of uh, communicate on here uh, with each other as well so we are really excited and we hope you are too have a wonderful tuesday and we cannot wait to see you for class and your one-to-one -one zooms this week bye